Hi guys, I have a candle review for you here today. Um, it's by Better Homes and Gardens, and it's in the scent Golden Maple Waffles. And when I first seen this candle, I was um, a little reluctant because sometimes maple scents for me can be a little bit overpowering. Um, but this one actually was not bad. It smells more like the bakery scent and more like butter. It's more buttery. The maple is in there, but it's more buttery. Um, and it's actually a pretty nice scent. Pretty, very sweet, but not overly sweet like um, a lot of maples can be, in my opinion. So this is the 13 ounce. Um, uh, oh, I don't know, kind of like the medium size, I guess. I mean, they have the larger size jars and then this size. Um, so I don't know if you want to consider that medium or small, whatever. Uh, genre, this came out, I believe, with their fall collection of scents. <clears throat> and it is a limited edition, it says. Um, season, like I said, they brought it out in the fall. To me, this is the kind of scent that if you're into melting or burning bakery, this could be something all year round. I don't see any limitations on it, really. The notes, like I said, mainly a bakery note, then butter, and then the maple. Single wick, 13 ounce. The wax is paraffin. It's a definitely a hard wax. You can see the when you get it brand new, you can see the marbling um, and everything, so it's pretty nice. The color is kind of like a dark tan, but with the wax pool here, it's it looks brown right now, but it is kind of like a dark uh, tan color, I guess. The price, I believe, is around three ninety seven or somewhere around there. Um, I got this on clearance after the holidays, so it was three dollars. Um, and to me, they're they're definitely worth three dollars. I usually don't pay full price for the Better Homes candles, um, unless it's a scent that I really really have to have. But this one I just picked up because it was three dollars in the clearance bin. Uh, I purchased it at Walmart, and I believe this is probably like the fifth or sixth burn. As you can see, totally clean burn all the way down. Absolutely no problems. Very, very deep, um, nice wax pool. Uh, absolutely no tunneling. Um, I know a lot of people do have issues with the Better Homes candles with tunneling and stuff, and what I would suggest is this, Alumalid. I don't know if you can see I have one on, but um, I'll leave it off for the rest of this video. Uh, it, it definitely makes a big difference, actually. In fact, when I first started melting Better Homes and Gardens candles, I did have performance issues with them. Not necessarily with the throw, but more so with the, the burn clean and tunneling and stuff. And after I started using Yankees Alumalids, that problem went away, and now I use them every time. In fact, I use Alumalids on every candle that will that it will fit, basically. A very nice performing candle. The wick right now is pretty large actually, but with the the um, Illumilet on it seems like it contains it a little bit better. Now that I have the Illumilet off you can see that flame is dancing around pretty pretty high in there. But anyways, I'm just going to give you a shot inside if you want so you can see how clean it is. Very clean and even and that flame is really really high and dancing around like it's nobody's business right now. Okay, so I melted this in my large area at one time, and usually when I had it melting, I had it melting with the Better Homes wax melts in this scent, and the wax melts in this scent are definitely a lot stronger. Uh, the candle, I would say, is probably a low to medium throw. I will admit, this particular scent in the, by the Better Homes has thrown a little bit better than some of their other candles. My average for Better Homes is usually on the low throw. 
I can I can smell it, but it's usually on the low end. Uh, this particular scent I noticed was more like a low to medium, so it did actually throw pretty good. So yeah, bakery, maple, and butter. You can actually smell that. You can kind of see the picture of that pat of butter sitting on top of the the waffles. It actually smells like that pat of butter on maple syrup and waffles. So pretty good scent. Um, I'm just going to keep this one kind of short because I don't really have too much else to say about it. And I have another review coming up pretty much right after this one. I believe it's another one of these candles as well. Okay guys, smell well.